Hi, welcome to Coffee Break Time with God. Uh, this is part one, Rapture. So I'm briefly going to discuss the Rapture and uh, I'll break it up into a small series because I, I don't always have a lot of time and I want to go deeper into it. Okay, so what is the Rapture? Basically the Rapture is um, an event that Christians believe is going to occur where the church will be raptured up, but first those who've been dead will rise first. So those being dead and buried will rise first. Um, and then we will meet God in the heavens. He'll be in the clouds. Um, but I prefer to read scripture so I can make sure I'm getting it properly. So it's something we all call the blessed hope. Those who are uh, pre-trib believers who believe it will occur before the tribulation um, for us, the rapture is our blessed hope, and I'll explain a bit more about that later. So Titus 2 verse 13 in the King James Version I'm reading from, looking for the blessed hope and the glorious appearing of the great God and our Savior, Jesus Christ. So Jesus Christ is our blessed hope. Now, if you go back um, into my previous videos, um, I have one on the ABCs of salvation. So if you haven't received God and been saved yet, that would be a really good one to watch. You, you'll see a lot of YouTubers posting who are um, of the same mind that the time is coming soon where Christ will God will come again and we need to be ready for ourselves, um, preparing ourselves. So that's why a lot of YouTubers are coming up with a lot more videos and content. Um, as you can see, lots of things occurring in the world. I'm just enjoying this beautiful park, this lovely tree. So if you see my eyes flicker that way, I'm just like, oh, so beautiful. God's creation is beautiful. But the way um, we humans have treated the world and it's a sinful fallen world, um, things are falling away and, and deteriorating there is beautiful things in this world beautiful people but um, without God yeah it's nothing is perfect without God and that's basically what it's all about so eventually everything's going to come back to him um, prophecy history history is his story God's story so getting back to it try not to diverge um, Nothing really needs to occur before the rapture. Some people think there needs to be a rebuilding of the temple, the third temple and things like that. The rapture is a separate event. Um, they say no one knows the day it will occur, but we can certainly know the seasons. And we're certainly seeing shifts um, in the current times that end times are near. We are in the end times, the end of the end. Um, and you can look more about that in Matthew 24 if you'd like. Yep, so I'll just refer to a few scriptures that um, that allude to the rapture. Philippians 3 verse 20 to 21, where it talks about how we'll receive glorified bodies. Um, and also Daniel 12 verse 1 to 2 talks about how I'd mentioned before, the dead will be raised um, so it's not simply for those living now, but it'll be the dead will be raised to life. Um, those who've been buried um, for time, for a, a while. Um, and then Thessalonians, I'm reading for 1 Thessalonians 4 verse 16, uh, 16 to 18. For the Lord himself will come down, this is describing the rapture, from heaven with a loud command with the trumpet call so we're going to hear a trumpet when this is occurring uh, the trumpet call of God and the dead in Christ will rise first after that we are, who are still alive are left and are left will be caught up together with them in the clouds to meet the Lord forever uh, in, I'm just trying to read my writing but basically, if, if you read 1 Thessalonians 4, verse 16 to 18, I think I'll put it in the description box below. I've just written on a small card. Um, yeah, I just had an appointment for my son. I'm just on my way to work now. I really never have much time for these videos, but I want to be spreading the gospel. I just feel called upon and the Lord speaking to me in these, these, these final moments because I really feel the time is drawing near. Um, so yeah, if you'll tune in more, I'll have a bit more later, um, Rapture Part 2, so just more depth to that, but basically, 
if there is coming a time where a lot of people will disappear, a lot of um, Christ followers, and there will be deception and there'll be more about that. But um, if you can just keep your eyes looking to the clouds, God is coming. See you next time on Coffee Break Time with God.